Hey, fellas. It's Zim from Shrek Gaming again, and I'm pretty excited. I just actually got the first set of 30 millimeters on the J7 Shinden. Uh, this is the Tier 8 Japanese uh, fighter. And the, the, you start out with 420s, and uh, I just, like I said, I just researched it, played one game, and I'm, <laughs> yeah, uh, they're fucking awesome. Uh, you know, the, the, these, uh, you know, you don't have much for, uh, you can't fire it for a long period of times, but the, the burst damage, especially when you get close and you do start hitting, oof. And uh, I, my, the game I just had actually was probably, uh, I believe is the best game I ever played in this game so far. You know, on, and this was my first tier 8. And I'm actually going to start, really start working on this plane that's trying to get up to the 9s. So the 9 actually in this game has, uh, will have a jet engine. The uh, W2 Shinden Kai uh, will actually have uh, a jet engine. Uh, what's makes these kind of unique is is uh, they have very good maneuverability, uh, especially at tier eight, and of course the large uh, set of four thirty millimeters. So uh, yeah, I said excited. Actually, the what did I end up with? Uh, at an ace, a little over three k damage, and uh, my highest XP that I've uh, ever produced. So. Uh, been a good night <laughs> so uh i'm gonna actually bring up the, the the gameplay of it uh it's still i do believe i have one more sets of 30 millimeters for this thing to get done before i can start uh onto the tier nine grind but uh i, I kind of struggle with this tank or this i shouldn't say tank sorry i've had tanks on the brain for the last two weeks uh i've kind of struggled with this airplane a little bit uh, with the 20s, uh, you know, it takes it's kind of a sucks with the stock grind to get through this, you know, with the with the engine and all that kind of stuff. So uh, finally, I, I got the first 30s, got the engine, and everything, all everything, all upgraded to the plane, and uh, definitely, definitely enjoying it. So uh, I'm gonna actually bring up the uh, gameplay for you. Uh, the 30s are, yeah, when you hit. You hit. <laughs> All right, so here's the uh, game for you guys, gameplay for you guys to watch, and uh, we'll talk to you there. All right, guys. So in the Shinden uh, National Park, uh, we have a tier nine game. Uh, well, actually, one tier nine, and rest are eights. Uh, and so actually, my buddy Mana is on the other side on the, in the tier nine. So uh, the Shinden, like I said, you know, this is. It's not a very good uh, power fighter, I guess you want to call it, energy fighter. Uh, you know, the, uh, the lacks a little bit on speed, and the uh, boost uh, is rather short compared to some of these other uh, fighters at tier 8. Well, like I said, first time, got the 30s, had to test them out, sound really nice. <laughs> a nice thump, 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 thump. So, uh, you know, even though it's not an energy fighter, uh, per se, uh, I do like to get as much altitude as I can because I hate getting jumped by heavies or just about any other those guys running those uh, heavy fighters or uh, specifically the Germans, you know, uh, with, the, with their power to weight and uh, the ability to get to altitude and have long, long boost uh, you know I prefer to get up as high as I can so I don't immediately let them dictate uh, how the fight's gonna go and you know and then this is once again it takes a while obviously if you've been playing the game for a while you know it takes a while before uh, the initial contact uh, you know uh, and then this is actually one of the things I really like about warplanes is, is that they always match up plane for plane uh, which they can do because of the bots. They can almost they they, they can match up plane for plane almost uh, what uh, you know. So there's not a mismatch. You know, two heavy fighters, two heavy fighters in the top tiers. You know, blah blah blah. Which is which is excellent. You know, that's one of the actual real nice things I like about this game is that 
and they let you do that. So back to the fight here. Uh, they're below me. Um, got a few above me, but uh, uh, I do have targets down here. And like I said, this is a pretty maneuverable aircraft for uh, tier eight. So uh, I'm looking for my first target. Yak 15 passes under me. Uh, so these are a little bit slower rounds to me. It seems like, but once you get <laughs> once you get that little pipper on where you need to be. Uh, yeah, it doesn't take very long if you get two or three hits with uh, with that burst of four to uh, really, really knock a plane out quickly. So uh, at this point, I'm just too far down. I've dropped too much altitude, and I'm not going to try to climb back up there against all that uh, those heavy fighters. So I'm just going to play play down low, which isn't you know necessarily a bad thing with this airplane uh, with its uh, maneuverability. So uh, lots of red down here. Uh, they're working on my. Uh, sure nice of him to go head to head with me <laughs> and that, that that's what what's really nice about that uh, you know before with the 220s or the 420s it wasn't always the best thing to do a, a trade like that one on one with uh, with, uh, with with another fighter uh, this is a little different uh, you know you start hitting him like that and that was, that was almost 400 damage off uh, with a couple bursts so Keeping it low, uh, trying to take out as I many of these fighters I can. Uh, yeah, you, you just saw that guy go wham. Uh, these these 30 millimeters are impressive. Uh, Accuracy-wise, you know I already suck at you know actually shooting shit, so uh, I, I'm, I'm assuming this is going to take me a little bit of time to get the uh, to really understand how these guns, uh, you know. The, uh, the lead on them. They seem to be a little bit outside of the pipper, uh, you know, you're, what you're shooting at here, so, um, you know, he's, he's kind of within range of what I can hit, so it was just kind of a, more of a feely, uh, see if I can lead him out far enough and maybe get a couple lucky hits. So, up three, up on three kills already, uh, diving in here on these last two ground attack planes, which is, you know, a fair amount of uh, um, HP and X, uh, HP left, as well as XP. Uh, you know, with that nice little pass there, you know, did a good almost 600 damage, I think, is what it was. Um, once again, you know, she's right on. Once you do get that uh, targeting down. These things is just wreck face, and I know I have it on other airplanes, but uh, this plane just really, really makes this plane. Uh, picking up these, uh, finally picking up these 30 millimeters, you know. So uh, hit him, rams in the wall, picks it out, gets me an ace, 3,000 damage, and 3,000 XP. So. Uh, yeah, my best game so far in World of Warplanes. So you guys have a good night, and uh, we'll be posting some more videos.